right, dudes, here we are at Doc Crammer Disc Golf Course. And so I'm gonna try to make a fly through video. I saw one online and I was like, you know what? I, I wanna try to make one of those too. So there's all kinds of obstacles here. Let's see if we can take a look. So you can see that there's all kinds of trees. So I'm flying a DJI Mavic Mini 2 or DJI Mini 2. This thing doesn't have any obstacle avoidance or anything. I'm flying it using the, the phone on the controller so the visibility is not great. Uh, I'm gonna try to fly the first hole here. This one's a short one. Let's see, man. So as suspected, that was extremely difficult. I couldn't get smooth shots. I mean, yeah, I can fly it in here, but the idea is you go straight from the tee box to the net with a smooth shot. A lot harder, well, as hard as I thought it was gonna be, actually a little bit more difficult than I thought it would be. So that's, this is attempt one. We'll see, maybe I can dial it in in the meantime, but that was tough. But yeah, we'll see what we got. I got something, take it home and unpack that and just see what it looks like. I'm gonna try to time lapse it from the tee box to the hole and just see if it works. So we'll try a time lapse from the tee box to the hole. Uh, let's try that out. So yeah, guys, that was my fly over the Doc Crammer disc golf course in Stafford, New Jersey. It was tough with the drone. That was holes one through six, as you saw. I started the video with seven because during the edit, I, I cut it six and I just had seven left over. I was like, oh, I'll start with that. So that's what ended up happening in the edit. On holes 10 and 11, I walked through with the GoPro just held in my hand. It seemed okay-ish. Like there was a little bit of, you could see kind of a fast, kind of wobble in it. The uh, stabilization wasn't picking up on the walking in a time lapse or something, uh, I don't know. And I even tried to stabilize it in Final Cut and it just didn't take those jitters out. So I'm not quite sure what was going on there. But those were holes 10 and 11. 10 and 11 were shot on a GoPro in time lapse mode and I just literally held it on a stick and walked through the the course like with a GoPro in my hand on time lapse. So yeah, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, you know, let me know. Uh, leave a comment, hit the like, do all that stuff. But either way, I hope you enjoyed it. Hope to see you next time. All right, later.